It's right here. There's no way you can shoot your target. There's no way you can do that. You can't do it. <laughs> Me and Mojo are playing. You cannot shoot. He's looking backwards. That's so cool. And the cool thing about it is, you're going to go for it. You are not going to go for that. That's too far away. Your tongue... <laughs> I told you, you, your tongue isn't that long, Mojo. we got to, like, analyze that. Anyway, so... Okay, this time I'm gonna hold the cricket at the camera so you can see what I see. I think Mojo likes crickets. Did you get it? All right, Cricket, I think you've had a good life. But it's time to meet Mojo.
Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hope he got that.
Come on, dude, get this cricket. We're talking about the cricket kick. Mojo, we are talking about the cricket crate. I need you to come off that limb and come eat this cricket. That's how this works, buddy. Okay, just to make this really weird for KiwiCo, I'm gonna let Mojo eat a cricket off of a cricket crate. I, everybody, mom and dad at home, uh, KiwiCo does not endorse this cricket being eaten by Mojo the Chameleon. You missed. You missed. <laughs> oh, the little grabby hands. Oh, that's weird. This, oh, this is not going according to plan. <laughs> okay. Boy, that was maximum weirdness. Mojo's crate of choice is the Cricket Crate, <laughs> which is a new crate that KiwiCo has that is geared towards children ages two plus. Do you endorse the Cricket Crate? I think you do. Anyway, if you would like a free box, go to kiwico.com slash smarter. I don't think KiwiCo endorses the Cricket Crate like Mojo does, but nevertheless, it's a new product that they have for ages two plus. So this is like, this is like extra special food. A hornworm? Yeah, a hornworm. That's like dessert? Yeah, he, he eats them occasionally. He might not eat it because it doesn't move a lot, but we can try to see if he'll eat is it. Is it like a big deal to eat a hornworm? They're, they're kind of expensive, more expensive than the crickets. Cr crickets are 15 cents, but he's a couple We're gonna dollars. do Mojo right. So. <laughs> How much did you pay for this? It was $3. $3? <laughs> Did you get me one? <laughs> <laughs> What's Mojo doing? Is he, is he keeping an eye out? Yeah, he might wander back over here. He's eyeing it. There you go. Right. There. Oh shoot, the cricket bit me. Or did something. There's a cricket up there. He's like, oh, I like that. So he's green right now, but he's got a red throat or an orange throat. What's common? Does that mean he's happy or sad? That's his most common color. Um, I think that's just like his, you know, chill. There's people around. Um, he's not really aggravated. But his most chill color when he's in the best mood is almost this color, like a dark, dark, dark green and a little bit of white. But when he's that teal, blue, that's just his people color. His his chilling out color. Yeah. I saw a lot of uh, I saw a whole lot of different chameleon colors online, and I gotta say I think he's got one of the better blends. He's got orange and mm -hmm. blue and green. I hope you enjoyed this video half as much as myself and Mojo. We had a blast. I hope you did too. Feel free to subscribe to Smarter Every Day. I make videos like this all the time. Uh, goofy stuff, serious stuff really anything that makes you think. I always heard about a chameleon tongue, but I never really knew how it worked. So I hope you learned something. I know I did. Anyway, feel free to subscribe if that's something you're interested in. If not, no big deal. I hope you enjoyed this video half as much as myself and Mojo, because it was a blast. Anyway, have a good one.